People always say, well, how do you like your new job? And I say, well, I stopped working seven years ago. It's passion because it's not work. It's what I love to do. Beer is special. And it's a great, it's a great job. Spent four years uh, working and living in Germany during the 1990s and just fell in love with German style beer while over there. When I got the idea to do the brewery, I, I thought it was a perfect thing for me. I love beer and I love the culture that surrounds beer. We like to say we make beer flavored beer. It's pure, it's all natural. The German culture is one where they focus on quality and purity, especially with the beer, and uh, I, I, I really appreciate that. So the Reinheitsgebot is a 500-year-old law that was enacted in Germany. Basically, it says that beer should be made from water, malt, hops, and yeast. Uh, I just appreciate uh, the, uh, the idea of taking uh, those four simple ingredients and making something that's wonderful. Well, the first thing we do is we start with barley malt or wheat malt, and we mill that malt. That malt is then put into the mash tun. Once we've completed the mashing, uh, then we move it over to the second vessel in the brewing process, which is called the louder tun. And so we separate the liquid off, uh, which we call wort. The wort then goes over to the boil kettle. Once the boil's complete, we then um, send it to what we call the whirlpool, after the whirlpool, it goes through what we call the word cooler, which is a heat exchanger. And then it goes into the fermentation tanks where the yeast is waiting for it. And after it's done lagering, we uh, filter it, package it, put it in the cold room. It goes out on trucks that week and goes to our customers, fresh every week. We brew in accordance with the Reinheitsgebot, which says there should only be four things in our beer. And so, and oil and grease are not one of them, right? We, we only want to have the four things in there. And so the last thing we want to have is oil and grease getting into our beer. Alice Capco is a great partner for the expanding microbrewery industry because of our innovation in the class zero compressors. Oil-free compressors are a fantastic fit for the microbrewery segment. We looked at a bunch of different uh, brands and um, uh, what, what impressed me about Alice Copco, first of all, the, the, the fact that they have compressors that are oil free that fit our needs was, was really a big plus. A nitrogen generator is, an, is a perfect addition to a compressed air system for a brewery because you can just separate the oxygen from the nitrogen and use the pure nitrogen to purge the tanks so you have an inert gas in the tank and it won't react with the beer and then you push the beer into the tank and push out the nitrogen. John's passion means a lot to us because it, it runs in parallel or is very much aligned with the passion that Atlas Copco has for the products and the standards that we hold for ourselves, the standards that we hold for our products and what we provide to the marketplace. We both don't believe in putting something in that a customer should have to worry about contamination on the outlet side. I want to be able to deliver pure, fresh beer to the people in Charlotte. And I think if I, if I do it right and I don't cut any corners, I think people will like it.